Is it fair to say you can tell the type of nigga that don't date black women? Yo, I heard a great take on that. I heard a great take from oh, a black woman. Oh, that the hairline is the yes. indicator. They, yes, I can see that. Yes, I can yes. see that. It was I like, yo, a black, like yes. a black woman would not let him step out the house with That's that true. goddamn, with that, with that hairline. Yeah. yeah, with that 1965, Basically. yeah. Civil rights. Yeah, that, that, and NAACP hairline is, is a... It's a red flag. Yeah, somebody just taught me the term bisexual lighting. Apparently, we need to add that. Oh man, y'all gotta get so so so. Josh is halfway there. You right. gotta get it more got the heterosexual lighting right yeah, now. This is no. Josh got that purple rain prince joint. No, ah, Josh, you gotta be. See, you gotta get a. You gotta mix something in there. But see what right. what comes out of my mouth like contradicts, and I, I, don't, I you know my heart is good. I mean well, but you know the shit they become, you know, like it's just like they like ah oh, this motherfucker. Like I'm you know I'm the worst one, you know, when it comes to that type of shit. <laughs> it's all good. They said I was a eugenicist. You got it. You got it. Oh Lord, he said you was a eugenicist. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, let Lord, me not. See. Let me not. Let me not break. <laughs> oh yo. yo. <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever it is, it, it's old news. It's we we know what was not, we know your heart. I didn't. Yeah, yeah, I didn't. My name is Bennett, and I ain't in it. <laughs> yeah, y'all bringing up old stuff, man. That's the thing. <laughs> then when you when you interpolate with the community, so one thing I'll you know it's a it's a gift and a curse. The community that we're connected to, a lot of the people that you've had on who are part of my crew, we are we have very we're, we're high standards in terms of like how how spicy these takes get and the thing that i'm trying to like get into if you go watch that video is i'm trying to like turn the temperature down on that a little bit because when people are used to being like mistreated in almost every aspect of their you know life they're ready mm -hmm. they're ready for they're ready off they're yeah. ready and i think mm -hmm. what people have to start doing more of is recognizing people's um, intentions, their blind spots, and like their will to do better. And so it's like, I had this whole video that you, you know, the last one where people were calling me a Nazi <laughs> um, <Yeah>. was, I <laughs> talked about accountability. What did you do? I was, I, <laughs> since I seen that on Twitter, I was like, nigga, what did you do? What this is you were do? the chosen one. What did you say? <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Oh my God. Right. right. You are the I'm, black I'm a Nazi. But, for you, FD. <laughs> That's I'm and that's so the thing is is right. It's so disappointing. Um, but the the short version is people you know need to kind of like be okay with accountability being about something people are pursuing. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And like making change and like pursuing change and growth. It's being a process. Listening and being open minded versus like here was your bad moment, your bad take. It's a wrap for you now. I'm about to kill you. Right, it's a wrap for you, and we gonna hold that over you all the time. Like literally, there are people. So I've, I've developed my anti fan base, and there are people that every time I pop up, they're gonna come and say the same three or four things that they don't like about me that make little to no sense. Um, but they're gonna come through. That's what they do, and they're trying to like spread their doctrine because that's 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 their thing. And so now one of them is I'm a Nazi. FDZ. <laughs> FDZ. I love FDZ. Hitler. FDZ now. FDZ. That's my nigga. Oh, shit. oh, Lord, Lord. No, but so, I think yeah. that's so, just like a sign of success that you're, unfortunately, that is one of these signs of success and the human condition because no matter what you do, whether it be the most positive thing on earth, you're always going to have haters. You're always going to have people talking shit about you, misinterpreting right. your words to fit their own agenda. So it's I, it's just like it's Mr. Rogers don't sucks. have no haters, though. I feel like Ooh. I'm sure he he Mr. would Mr. If, Rogers, if he was on Twitter. If he, if was, on Twitter, if he was on Twitter, still, if he was a Twitch streamer, right he right still have it. He has absolutely. <laughs> Mr. Rogers yeah, don't have haters because better, he wasn't alive. He was in the military. There you go. See, Mr. Rogers in the military. He's a fascist. Oh, true, 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 true. That's how it is. Damn, he was in the military. Now I kind of don't like it much no more. Okay, we've spread it. You know, last Ross, time you Bob. were on, you got us in uh, trouble too, because I said what? that Trevor Noah was married to a white oh. woman, and you didn't correct me, and these motherfuckers lit me up. You should have. You should have known better, Tefty, and you should have told me 
because these motherfuckers <laughs> lit my ass up because not only is he not married, there is no white woman, and they did not appreciate me putting lies on that man's oh, name. Oh, there's it's white women, but he's not married. To right. Him. Okay. It's only a matter of time. Oh, my brother okay. Trevor, no, he he out there, right? Yeah. <laughs> he's, okay. he's, that's, he's but that's just it. like he's I know that I know he was on the docket. Flower. I just like I know he he's on the docket. I don't know if we want to jump into him already. We gonna get into it when we get it. We gonna get into it when we get the actual part. But no, no. But we can we can you can say you know. Oh, just like is is it fair to say you can tell the type of nigga that don't date black women? I wouldn't have called him for that though. But not that. I, I know, oh, you talking about you talking about majors or no? Oh, wait, who are you talking about? I'm talking oh, about Jonathan Majors. That's what oh. I was talking about. Yeah, I would have okay. called. You wouldn't have called really? that. I yeah, wouldn't call it. He just has the, uh, He has that civil rights old school. Like he doesn't get his hair. Like he. Did, I don't know. He does. He didn't have. What? I wouldn't have. Yeah. Nah. Yo, I heard a great take on that. I heard a great take from oh, a black. Oh, that woman. the hairline is the yes. indicator. They, yes. I can see that. Yes. I can yes. see that. It was like, yo, a black that. like yes. a black woman would not let him step out of the house with that's that goddamn with that with that hairline. Yeah, yeah with that nineteen sixty five. Yeah, and, that, and I think that's why we say he looks like. Yeah, he wouldn't. Yeah. Yeah, he looks like he could have been in emancipation. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that, that and NAACP that's... hairline is is a. Uh, but see, but it, but he he wore it differently because I think I think what we're talking about because they said the same thing with the with sister sisters, they said that you can mm. tell which one of them dates white men, which one dates black men. You talking about T and Tamara? Black men, T and Tamara, yeah. yeah. Okay. Sister, yeah, yeah. You know. Okay. Yeah. okay. Um, <laughs> um, and they said that you can div- in the same way you can divine which one of them is dates black men and which one doesn't. I I agree that like a more scraggly or like a dude that's got like straightened hair, those could be indicators. But Jonathan Major's hairline gave more like rustic black man vibe. It gave more like, like Anthony Hamilton. Exactly. Um, Childish Gambino. So, but so yes, is Childish Gambino only dates he, white women. Yeah, that is true. Yeah. <laughs> that like and, no yo, if you've ever seen an unkept hairline, like yo, that's that's it's Gambino. But Gambino so, don't Gambino. have the hairline to to even fuck with. Even, his, or no, yeah, or that's like the best. That's, that's, that's his best. Yeah, yeah. that's his He's best. That's his best, his best bet. Because his shit is is like <laughs> if he tried to shake that up, he'd look like <laughs> Jamie Foxx. That it, going natural it works for his hairline. But you're no. Guys, I'm doing the best I can. You think of, does Chiwetel Ejiofor have a have a, a white woman? Let's look this up because you might. Mm. Let's. Oh man. To this. I, I, I love I love making up games on the spot. I wish we no. had a chat. Rup- I wish Rup- we had Rup- a chat. Name that hairline. Hit name. Hit <laughs> no. hit on the game. Does this nigga date black women? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> okay, let's. Got to put the emoji in there. <laughs> Does this ninja date black women? No. Who who's the person that you're talking about? I can so right up. now we're on Chiwetel Ch- 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 He's um, thank you. Who's what's he from? Um, how do, how he's been a lot of the earth. Uh, yeah. World War Z. Twelve Not years a slave. Z. Twelve years a slave. Yeah, he's twelve years a slave. That's probably his most Chiwetel, well-known twelve joint. Twelve years a slave. All right, so I'm oh, looking. Oh, it's I'm a look, white woman. It's a white <laughs> woman. All right, so but but it's a black woman in here too. Hold on, let me see. This might be his child, actually. Let me see. Hold on. Uh no, I'm seeing all uh, yeah, white no, women. That's a wife. That's a wife. Yeah, no, I he might he might have had a black woman earlier. No, but this, this is I think this is his child standing next to him actually. Oh no, no, Francis yeah, so. at ten year. Hold on, let's see if they dated. No, Suzanne Neville. Well, all right. So the, the the daughter looked like she black though. No, no, no. Okay, okay. no, no, no. He he, no, he this, dated this is black his... women. All right, she was because the... and Francis Etenier, Eten, Eternier, attorney. I don't know how to say that one. The the parameter is: Do they almost exclusively? Because 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 I will she give. Would tell any, passes. I, I'm not. She yeah, would tell I'm passes. not. I'm, yeah. Do they almost exclusively date? Do they completely exclude black women like eighty percent of the time? So if you've dated, if you if you're Michael B. Cause you know Michael B. Yeah, just yeah, loves Michael B. He, he's dated, so yeah, he's dated it's not, black. It's not, so, it's not but Michael B. Jordan though. definitely dates black women. Like he, yeah, like I think he, I feel on. like he, he would marry a black woman. But this guy, to a tail, to a tail. No, no, he packed, bro. He, d- like, I'm with FD. Like he, yo, buddy, you, really? buddy, what, buddy was mixing. He was well, mixing in the brown, but now he's with the swirl. But is it multiple white women? Is it multiple white women, or it's just the same white woman over and over again? That don't count. That's copy paste. Yeah. yeah, you so, can't so, take so, extra. You can't we, take extra points off for the same white woman that he's showing we up. We gotta to make said. categories. We gotta make categories. <laughs> he so got we to gotta divide like, it up. <laughs> well, right, we're so, gonna make it oh, scientific. This shit about to be oh, no, Dungeons no, no, and Dragons by the time we end up. We fucking roll. You gotta roll a twenty. If you want to make this empirical, we gotta create create distinct. We gotta operationalize this whole. We got Umar approved. So Umar approved means that's a gold star pro black dater. 
You you only date never, black women. That's Umar ever. approved. Okay. Okay. Never touched, that's never so, tasted so that's, vanilla. That's, Don't even like that's vanilla me personally. Wait, can you brag. transition? Okay, what if? Wait, wait, you've never? I've never dated a white woman. Oh, but your wife is your like an early partner. Yeah, we 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 met. In that time. don't count. That's cheating. Ooh, okay, cheating. all right. But let me ask you. Let me ask you. Well, let me yeah. ask and then I went to HBCU. Counts, but, yeah. Let me ask but you. I, but, oh, but to be okay. real, I probably would have never dated a white woman. Like I just okay, uh, but okay. So we say, say dated. We okay. say dated. Yeah, <laughs> but 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 have you ever um, fornicated? Oh, he's counting. He's counting. I've never fornicated. I've never fornicated with a white woman. Damn. I'm, I'm counting. I'm counting. I've never had intimate contact. I've never had. I've never had. Have you ever? I've never had consensual intimate contact to be to keep it a hundred. It was probably one of the reasons why I messed with white women. That sounds wild. Multiple white women. Oh, okay. On your end, okay. You you have me. Boy, I was like, yo, no, don't do this. Oh, come on, come on, this stream. Come out here raping white bitches. Jesus Christ! I've never had consensual contact with a white woman. He's a victim, bro. I'm getting too comfortable already. I'm getting too comfortable already. He's a victim. No, I think I mean I don't want to go there, but you, I'm sure you all have experienced that. There's like some really aggressive white women um, that you, yeah, that you yes, have met. Yes, but I, yeah, yeah. I, and I've, yeah. I've had a half, like a couple of negative experiences in that way, but I don't think I've gotten the like mm. like what you, the level of what you're describing. I, okay. Well, Eddie, you better be lucky. Alvin ain't but here. But also, let me just acknowledge like I'm sorry they did that. I'm sorry that happened to you. Like I feel like we blast past shit like that a little bit too because even foreign said some shit uh. that was kind of like. I don't know. I don't like. To, I don't like blasting through that shit. Like, oh, it's just true, a, true, true. like a funny little whatever. It's like that's some fucked up shit. So, yeah. true. I pre I appreciate that, and that, and that is oh, yeah. that is the correct response to kind of yeah. get space for that. Um, but getting back to the funny part, I had some jokes coming. Let's so we go. got okay. Umar approved. <laughs> yeah. Then we got down with the swirl, and then we got meaning Van you're Jones. willing to. You're willing, yeah, willing to, to. Okay. Right. So we got three categories: Umar Proof, Down mm -hmm. with the Swirl, Van and Jones, Kanye. You, meaning you only, you're exclusive only. on one side. That's of pretty much all you do. Wait, did you say Kanye? Kanye ain't dated black women in Amber twenty Rose years is black, now. No? Oh, okay, but yeah, fair enough. Well, well so Amber, Amber Rose, Rose is black. when he break up with Amber, Amber Rose, what he did, Amber Rose. That was too, like fifteen like. years ago, and I mean right, she's so just barely black. Amber but, Rose is black enough to say nigga. I would say so. I'll give her she's that. Not, she's yeah. not. She's not white enough to pass the white. Yeah, she's yeah. not yet. Hey, but logic thank ain't. You. No, logic ain't, you, it's fucked nigga. up. Thank you. Because logic ain't even black enough to say nigga. And that's the craziest thing to me because that's he's the going to get past the J. Cole. That's the, yeah, he's Drake. The, so he's the paper bag. He's the. If, you, like, if you're just blacker than logic, then you can. But anything else. You can less say than, nigga and nobody should say anything to you. I Once you get logic, to logic's I think area. Logic, the problem with logic is he refuses. He doesn't have the hairline. I think if logic had the hairline, he could Sean King it and, and bungee yeah. it up to being able to say nigga. But he, he chooses that like. Super yeah. white boy aesthetic. I yeah. think if he that, hairlined that's it up, the, pro he could the problem with pass. logic. Yeah, the problem with logic is that see, if you want to say nigga, which we're gonna use as like a a a, a stand in for yeah. for attaching to blackness, right? Sure. If you want to say nigga, you got to put some money down. You can't just be, you can't put yourself <laughs> you in a position, <laughs> right? You you, you can't put deposit. yourself in a position to to still <laughs> that like is true. you got to – that's that's my rule. Oh, fuck! Now you're making me revert because I'm very in defense as a as a brown skinned person. On principle, I'm very in defense. Yeah, I'm on principle. I'm because like it's what's that? Uh, Alvin pointed it out. It's like that quote about the Jewish people. Like they came for my neighbors and then they came for these and then when they came for me, there was nobody <laughs> left. So I'm like. I got to keep the line at where logic right. is because otherwise it's going to start, you know, encroaching and, on me. And please believe there are black folks that will tell you you're not black on some on some wild L eugenic luckily, shit. Luckily, I'm, I'm in enough of a space to where I'm like, I don't have to I don't have to engage with that. Like, it's not enough yeah. that I have to actually give it attention, but it is there. So I'm like, they were really giving this man logic flack. But what you just said kind of changed my mind because I'm like, if you're going to say you're black, you got to move all the way black like drake does or j cole does but i feel like logic allows himself to move as white exactly he moves and his faces as a obviously white person and and that's not mm. you can't have it both ways mm. yeah that that's where okay. it changes to me it's not even just like it's like what who, who are you putting your stake down in the community with are you opening yourself up to police scrutiny if you open, if you no. open yourself up to police scrutiny, then I will. I'm gonna give Bobby. you the pass yeah, that you de not, describe. Yeah. But, but logic definitely becomes yeah. Bobby Roberts when yeah. <laughs> when the police come around. And so in that case, Very true. I'm I'm gonna let them I'm gonna let them cook. But I'm not going down. I'm I not have down to. that hill. I have I have to. But <laughs> you, have to. you make a you make a good point. <laughs> I'm a little. I'll let them cook. I'm gonna let them yeah. cook because like it's he also if you don't give it to. 
He yeah. does, no, because yeah. for me, I'm like he was like raised in a biggest, black family in a black that's household. What, that's the biggest indicator for me is what who were you raised in community with? Whose right. struggles were you part and parcel of? What food were you right. fed? What traumas did you go through because of experiencing people in your family similar. being affected by race? That's that is the the thing that constructs your race or one of the big ones. I but would getting say. back to it's so and the, and logic getting back to the original thread we were on. I don't think he's ever dated black women. Logic, you know? eh, yeah. Ooh, okay, all right. Let, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Do y'all think black women wanted to date him? I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. Well, at least it's, some, it's enough least black some, women that love making, white passing you're, you're and white You're not dudes. making a bad point though. Like well, I, have I you, think I understand the underlying point that you're making. Yeah, like okay, every black that's woman that's been attracted to you that was willing to date you, did you want to date them? In verse, in like in terms of his selection, I'm just he throwing would it have out had there. he would have had more than enough selection that there was at least somebody within that. Have group you looked that at? He is he with one of his day ones? Before the is thing, he, is he with a day one? I don't know. No, that's his, mm, see, that's no, the, yeah. I don't that's know. A, that's don't also know. a good point. Is he a, is he logic or is he Kanye? I mean, right. is he Chance or is Kanye? He Kanye definitely had a day one. Uh, I just oh, I but Kanye I, left his day one. Chance still with his day one. You know, yeah. Chance day one. So there's a lot of dudes. Anyway. I just I, Every, I'm I of mean, the mind he gets that black for it. In fact, yeah, I'm of the mind that most that there's black flack for a bad album. That yeah, well yeah, because he said it. But you hold on. We know the the flack that Chance gets for his his partner. Like it's quite extreme. The, don't you got like a bunch of kids? Well, that are we, gonna, or are we, are we about to have Christian. another Trevor, Trevor Noah situation uh, yeah, with Chance got, the Rapper? Hey, you know what? Mm. I, I'll say right now, I don't give a fuck about false information when it comes to celebrity guy. Like I so <laughs> don't give a fuck. Like it does not matter. It's not. It's not discourse. We talking shit. Like who cares? So I don't know. Yeah, Logic got seventeen kids. <laughs> he shares a child with Nick oh. Cannon, actually. <laughs> they have fathers they of one <laughs> one child. <laughs> Looks like Logic got two kids. Child. Okay, La- Logic, La- not, not, not Logic, but Chance the Rapper Chance, got two kids. Because they both got like philosophy names. You know what I'm saying? Chance, Logic, Logic and Reason, Marley. Rationale. Reason. Like, I don't know. <laughs> reason. Reason. reason is a rapper, though. <laughs> like, reason. Oh, yeah, probably is. Is. Currency. It probably I don't know. Is. Yeah. Cur- <laughs> yeah. Yo, just concepts, don't bring currency yeah. into this, though. <laughs> That's my nigga. <laughs> I know what Logic's but, wife is white, though. Yeah. So I thought he got divorced from uh, yeah. her. What he did. He, no, so he he got divorced from his first white wife in 2018, <laughs> his first and then married wife another. Crazy. And married another white wife uh, in 2019. <laughs> and she real white. This a white. This a white girl white. She the got one before that was white white. white. Like the first do we wife mean was, like how white? Do we mean valley or we mean Scandinavian? She, Scandinavian. Oh Jesus. Okay, got mm, you. Got yeah. you. Factory reset white. The originators. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, gotcha, Built gotcha. the oh, we was ca- we was Vikings type white. Right, Vikings. Yes, yes. Yeah. Um, so I don't know. There was a point to that to that tangent of, but I I always think it's I, I think it's we hairline amusing testing. hairline testing. Yeah, uh, amusing to look at certain dudes going back to something Josh was saying. Like, so I agree that there are if you have a certain type of black woman, and you can't find that type, you'll find a type right. of another type of woman that you like so i agree with that but i just feel like generally speaking when i hear black women didn't like me i'm real skeptical you know what i'm saying Mm. same thing with like i had that criticism of uh donald glover you know what i'm saying and his his like clear isms around black women it's um, a little least, it's a little yeah because when you said he was because i I was listening because i'm a big gambino fan been a fan from day one me too and I'm listening to like I'm I'm back to like Derek comedy days. I've been following this nigga for right. you know 15 years. Me too, years. me too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm with and, you. But a lot of his like when he when he made his first album that was actually listenable because the first three were atrocious. But like, when he came yeah. out with Cul de Sac, I was like, uh, there's definitely this weird undertone of like. Uh, black women are a nice little like like uh, technically like technically I know I have to put this in the track. It's a weird little like yeah. I date black, I, I date white, I date Asian, I date uh, white uh, right, girls. Black. I don't like. <laughs> what is that line? It's a it's a line. It, I call them incel bars, and I got that oh, from you, one of my homies. Oh, you talking about bonfire? He said, I, I, "Wait, he said, uh, oh. fuck white." <laughs> Uh, I love pussy. I, I should. Oh, oh my yeah, God. I it's should a, be running Peter. It's an yeah. amazing I love, line. I love pussy. But it's I love also bitches, awful. man. I should be running Peter. Like, <laughs> but what's the line? Because the line before that was like, I like white, I like black, something like that. I was just yeah, listening, it, that's bonfire. I was just listening to that song. It, it is an amazing line that could not exist in 2023 at all. Um, now I got to oh, move it, white girls like this. Coke up my ass crack. Move black girls because, man, fuck it, I'll do either. And that's exactly, I think, the kind of thinking of what I'm – it's like it's like a 
eh, okay, I guess. If it's available. Yo! I'm not I'm not hungry, but I could eat type energy. Yo, Twitter would have his ass for that lot in 2024, 2023. <laughs> fuck yeah. black girls, because fuck it, I'll do either. Like, <laughs> like black That's girls is very passive. over food. It's, it's very you know passive, yeah. Like, yeah. if it's available. Yeah. Look, if, the, yeah, I mean, if, like, if she's if light enough. Coke, Pepsi will do. It's like, Is she from the valley? Because yeah. I can do maybe that, you know. It's a little bit off. It's a little bit and, off. And, little and going back to, like, the, the, what we were saying, I don't know if you were recording when I was talking about it, but, like, the type of scrutiny we be under, imagine that type of passive, like, negativity, like, revolving you at all times. And now I can let you know directly in my comment sec- in your comment sure. section or on Twitter how I feel about that. So I just so I mostly don't mind it, but I'm like, but it's not at the level of because you know if we keep doing this, you know, obviously, and especially fucking with y'all video essay niggas, it's like, man, we getting a whole different type of you know what I'm saying? We're going into a different ecosystem that because before it's you know it's mostly like it's a comedy sex podcast, you know, but once we start doing this, I'm like, oh man, we about to have some different type of comments. Real careful, we gotta be real. And And I think I'm ready for it, but I'm like, because I got a pretty thick skin when it comes to to that kind of stuff. I'm like, I get it people talk i don't mind that it's part of the conversation i even kind of invite it but you know I, yeah maybe I, I don't necessarily fully understand the breadth of it and after you say whatever you're about to say we'll stop the like i'll let the patrons go and we'll get into the episode well i i, just, I think it's it's growth right because like here's the, the thing I, I i'd say a lot and it's hard i think for people to like engage with based on my persona and who i am now but like 10 years ago when i was i figured closer to y'all age <laughs> I wasn't this well versed in all these different perspectives and isms and experiences. <laughs> I was, break. I was, you know, I was sure. just I at, at best. And then I got in community with different people, and I and I said the wrong thing a few times. And I was lucky enough to have people be like, "Nah, give you grace. This not that. That not this. Give me some mm. grace." And and because and the reason why like I wouldn't have even introduced y'all to like people I, I fucks with or if I I don't I don't I don't want to low let people know like yeah don't fuck with them my bad y'all like <laughs> that podcast was terrible I hated my experience Yo, like I, I was really I, I tried I, was, it. <laughs> I wouldn't I been wouldn't there call done that it. these motherfuckers are out of their minds which right. wouldn't have been an unfair assessment either <laughs> right no I wouldn't have done that if I felt like because this I I think it's important especially for black men to see people making uh just progress in terms of like one open themselves up to new perspectives showing cordiality and commonality without Mm -hmm. having it be content farming rage baiting stuff just be like oh here's a thing fight yeah Yeah, everything got to be a fight I'm, i'm open to this conversation yes this is content but it's designed with an earnestness in mind you know what i mean Versus like some people, I, I get criticism for not having conversations with certain people, and I'm like, because y'all don't want a conversation, y'all want to, y'all want to see me get up there yeah, and fight with this motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all want buck fighting, and I'm not about to do that with y'all, yes. uh, especially about. With, by the way, uh, all the debate bros. It's mostly the debate bro people. Oh, the, and the black the man the white leftist people. They want you to debate those guys. Oh uh, no! So th- we're talking yeah. about two different types of white leftists. We're talking okay, about like yeah. white leftists. Y'all are kind of. In, in bed with a little bit people I'm connected oh, okay, to, yeah. and but then the we talking about the, the debate the, stream people. Yeah, okay. Des- Destiny, I'm sure y'all know who Destiny is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nah? yeah. yeah. So Destiny, yeah. Um, Vosh are the two biggest ones. Hunter um, Avalon. Yeah, Hunter Avalon. All those folks. There. The thing with them that I take the main thing I take issue because if you if you analyze their politics at a base level, it's close enough for me. Other people not. Not so mm. much, but for me, it's close enough that I'm not going to ever invest a I lot feel of like time. Close enough has a lot of value, like because I I've worked like in actual like real life shit. I've worked with people to do mobilization stuff where it's like you're positive, but we're both we're both union members, so we got to right. get we got to get some policy in place that raises the minimum wage. Like I understand maybe you have some queer phobic vibes, but like we got to get this done. That's yeah, right. what shit is in the real world. I, so I've helped rescue sex trafficking victims with devout Christian conservative people. And it's like this right. this young lady that is trying to escape her pimp does not care about your anti right. you know, your your, your, your issues right, right now. Pronoun, yeah. And I'm willing to I'm willing to to dis, like I'll disregard that because that's not like I'm not gonna center my political comfort zone in the face of like Necessary material things, right? action, yeah, material action, and I think that's really important, especially for black men to see, because I think black men feel like because they can't talk all the talk all the time, because right. we're not 
we're not encouraged. We're, we're, this is scarier for us, I think, in a way, because oh. you, you, we, we had like pause is still a thing. You know what I mean? Pause is like, funny, but I feel like it, it's, but, it's are, funny. Are people, but like are people it, still but, saying pause unironically though, because I feel like I, pause I, is funny. I still say pause all the time. That shit is hilarious. I, I don't know. I, think I say some pause on are. shit that's not even gay. Like pause because it sounds like some. Because I think I said something. I was commenting on some TV show, and what I said sounded kind of serial killerish. Because I was like, <laughs> and I was like, da 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 da. Pause. Like just on, like no killer. Like just no so killer. Understand what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> but but you get my point mm. in terms of like. It, we have to show progress, but getting back sure. to but so it's showing progress, and then like with the debate people, that's just their sport, that's their favorite entertainment. So they don't really actually care about the issues they're talking about. Of they just getting wanna, anything done. They want to pull up from from you know and dunk the, on motherfuckers. The, and that, dunk no, that on is true because it it does seem like the same. Um, and after I say this, we'll continue, but I'll, I'll, I'll um, let right. the patrons go. But it does seem similar to the fresh and fit that is mostly just about. Be sh creating content for people who enjoy seeing people get dunked on, not for furthering the conversation or winning over hearts and minds or breaking down an idea and challenging an idea. Um, all right, yeah. um, patrons, I'm gonna let y'all go. Um, was there anything in the chat that we needed to address or anything like that? No, 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 no. Okay, cool. Um, we'll see y'all later. Thank you very much. Pot will be out. This this live will be up soon, and we'll see y'all next week. Peace, peace. It's a red flag.